so good morning all today we will be learning about the block editor but the main thing i am going to explain to you is about how to actually uh, import various blocks like doors windows annotations into your uh, drawing into your autocad drawing and of, of course and how to edit them apart from that there is some the master tools i'll be using so first of all you need to press escape so that the command prompt is blank so here you need to type tp all right tp tool palette enter and it will open a tool palettes uh, window for you and here you have various uh, pre made uh, block editors for you now we we will we can go for door imperial you just click it here bring it here delete the previous one now here <coughs> it shows you that it can be here the master grid can show you that it can be easily open to 45 degrees to uh, 60 degrees and to 90 degrees as well uh, and you can even close it but the thing is if we have a wall of four and a half inches this is the wall thickness this part we have wall thickness we have four and a half inches or nine inches then how to actually do this and uh, make the width of the door uh, you know a variable so what you do is just click this block and block click this and double click you will go to block editor it will open the block editor for you I'm going slow so that you can see see this is the block editor basically uh, here there's something called door size you just click here and right click and you go to properties and here you have something called distance value all right you please check it carefully this is distance value list I do it again when you do right click you just do click door size right click and go to properties and scroll this bar and there is something called value set under value set there is distance type and the distance value list you click ahead this is the ellipsis button okay this is ellipsis so click it here now here already the door size has been predefined no but you want a door size of your size maybe say um, uh, three feet three inches maybe just so you can just type it three feet three inches okay and you can just say add and okay so that has been added so you can see the linear distance of angle or angle defined for a value set okay and then you can just close it and then say close block editor and say save changes save changes the moment you say save changes now you will see that it can be easily open to this four inches uh, four, uh, four feet then three then three feet four inches then three feet three inches also then three feet three feet whatever the visual preference so we have defined three feet three inches a uh, additional value you can check it again you can go to the okay and you click it here you right click you go to properties and there is something called value set so you can define more also like uh, you want a uh, door with a small size of one feet eight inches huh? you can just say add and it okay so uh, it will create this for you also uh, similarly you can go to the wall thickness as well right click wall thickness you scroll it down and uh, you want a wall of uh, maybe uh, <coughs> of uh, 7.5 inches only so you can uh, do it also the seven and a half inches so it will uh, define it for you also and you can say block editor <coughs> uh, sorry save changes now you can see it see now here you have a there is a scale coming up over here I can press also. So uh, there is six and a seven and a half inches okay you can just define it you can just modify it and here you can even increase it decrease it whatever you feel like this is three feet. all right so this is how you can do this similarly if you press TP again you have various blocks here like window imperial and other uh, blocks like aluminium window so you can you know define and modify uh, them the each and every block as per your sweet wheel as per your own you see I'm increasing here also you can increase or decrease the distance values okay and similarly here also this is the window so you can also see 
there is scale coming up here so this is the the basic idea behind making this video is that just to educate you people that there are so many things in AutoCAD which we are still not you know uh, exercising them and just ignoring them but this this can of be of very high usage to you guys okay so thank you friends thanks for watching and be good and do good jai hind thank you